Hey everyone, and welcome back to another action video. So today is Sunday. Hopefully everybody has had a fantastic day so far. So today, we have a new band to the channel. This is Forevermore with their song Nascent. This one was, this song was suggested by um, Lord Loquat, so thank you for the, for the suggestion. I really do appreciate it. Um, a little bit of backstory on Forevermore. I have heard of the band before. Um, I've maybe heard one or two songs, um, don't remember the names of them, I think they were on Sirius XM Radio or something. I just happened to stumble across them, I don't remember the names or anything, I don't re really remember what it sounded like, honestly. But yeah, I've heard these guys are pretty good from sources on Facebook, Instagram, um, Twitter, all that. So yeah, I'm excited to hear, um, what Forevermore has in store, um, like I said, I've never heard the song before, and yeah, um, don't know what to expect, so just hopefully it's freaking good. So yeah, let's just get right into this. So without further ado, let's get started. Sunday, hopefully everybody's doing well. Last day of the weekend, unfortunately. But let's make it a good day. Let's go. What do you have for me forevermore? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Freaking heavy. That is freaking heavy, dude. Yeah. Wow. Alright, let's see what you have for me. Yeah! Ah, oh, that's a lit right there, man. Yeah! Alright, so that was Forevermore with her song Nascent. Wow. Or Nascent, whatever you guys. I don't know how you pronounce it, but anyways. 
Wow, man. Thank you again, Lord Loclot, for the suggestion. I really do appreciate it. Wow, man. Holy freaking crap. So, I was getting all types of lights with him. Um, I was getting Silent Planet vibes. I was getting, uh, what other vibes was, what was I getting? Um, as a matter of fact, let's, if I type in, well, for a second, guys, if I go to, I just want to type in their name on um, Spotify to see what related artists it sound like. Forevermore. Okay. Related artists. Um, okay, I can see that. Yep, Silent Planet and Neil was going to be in there. Um, yeah, you can see some news news right here. Yeah, man, so... Like I said, I was getting like Silent Planet vibes. I could see Dayseeker in there. Yeah, I was getting all types of vibes, man. Overall, the video was very, very... Um, I can see it was filled with a lot of power, um, raw emotion. I saw car crashes everywhere. Um, I don't know the backstory about it. Maybe it was about somebody that um, lost their lives for a loved one, and the band that lost their lives, or what they were feeling at the time, unfortunately. But yeah, that's what the kind of sense I was getting throughout the music video. It's in the song itself. Holy freaking crap, man. I was not expecting that at all. For some reason, I thought Nora Forevermore was kind of like, um, <laughs> I did those two, for the for Forevermore and Evermore. Mixed up way too much. Um, but anyways, yeah, man. I was not expecting that. The song itself. Holy freaking crap, dude. So, um, yeah, like I said, he had that strong metalcore act. I was getting some Fit for a King in there also. Especially with the vocals. But let's start off with the, in the instrumentation first. Holy crap, man. So, I thought the guitars was on point too. It was very, very heavy. Very, very fast. Along with the bass players also. Holy freaking crap. And then the drumming was lit too. It was just freaking passionate, heavy all throughout. Um, it's kind of like a roller coaster between um, the fast paces um, and then when the chorus hit. And then, <laughs> then that freaking GC breakdown towards the climax of the song. Holy freaking crap, that was good. Um, it was strong. It was powerful. It was angry. It was. Um, very technical, um, had those electronic sounds in the background whenever you would get low, um, and whenever the boys got low also. But yeah, and then um, it finished off of the, um, like I said, the chorus again. So yeah, dude, I thought the song itself was very, very well put together. Um, I thought the music video, um, like I said, the color scheme, everything about it, um, you could really feel that raw emotion and kind of what's going on um, with the lyrics itself and the song itself or whatever. Um, but yeah, I man, overall, I thought the song was great. Um, all aspects, instrumentation, the vocals were great. Um, yeah, like I said, I got those um, Silent Planet vibes from Garrett from Silent Planet, Ryan from Fit for a King, and, and even Rory um, from Dayseeker. Yeah, man, all those, um, I got all those vibes from the vocalists, and yeah, he was freaking good, man. So, thank you again, Lord Loclot, for the suggestion. I really do appreciate it. Holy crap, I was not expecting this at all, man. Um, but yeah, um, freaking crap, it was an amazing song. I will definitely be checking them out um, more on Spotify. I will be definitely listening to more of their stuff. I'll probably do that today. Because for some reason, I have still yet to check out the new Parkway Drive album, which I don't know why it's taking me so long. But today, I'm going to sacrifice myself, and I'm going to listen to it in peaceful quietness so I can hear, um, so I won't have any external distractions around, so I can be focusing on it. But anyways, yeah, going back to Forevermore, I thought the song was fantastic. I will definitely be checking these guys out more. So yeah, um, Lord of Oakland, if you or anybody else wants me to react to more Forevermore, make sure to put that in the comments below. 
Other bands do the exact same. All my upcoming concerts I'm attending is in my about tab in my description box on my channel. Follow me and admin on all my other social media accounts. Those are in the description box as well. If you did like this kick button song from, for, from Forevermore, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, and if you're new, make sure to subscribe so you, you will never miss any more of my videos. So yeah, guys, like I said, this is the first reaction video of a double header on this Saturday after Cinco de Mayo. And I will see you guys in my second and final reaction video. Bye-bye, guys.